hi guys welcome to my videos so guys today in this video we are gonna see how to submit e-travel philippines one-stop electronic travel declaration system for travel to philippines so before i proceed further if you have not already subscribed to my channel please go and subscribe right now so guys uh, more and more countries are replacing their paper arrival card to electronic systems to better track it and uh, better uh, save the data and of course manage paper waste no doubt with the advancement of technology so philippines similarly has migrated to this e-travel dec uh, declaration whereas this is a single stop as they have written one stop electronic travel declaration system and this is free to use and i have opened it from the official website as you can see so there could be some fake websites because uh, scammers can always do similar stuff so it does not require any kind of payment so do not fall into trap so if you open this page, you will have like two options, Philippines passport holder, foreign passport holder. Philippines is a very popular travel destination, so a lot of people come here every year, even from foreign countries. So transportation time, like I'm just pulling it a sample, okay. Air, okay. Then uh, date, and you can submit it in three days in advance. So let's say you are coming here. Email, and then uh, click on continue. So I'm going to do that. Now it has gone to the wizard, and as you can see, it is of six step. So in the first, they are collecting your personal information, name, passport details, citizenship, and mobile number. So and then you are gonna do it at next. So I'm gonna do this. In the next step, it asks for your uh, uh, address. So I'm gonna put some information. Then it asks about your travel details. This is step three. So I'm gonna put some information: country of origin, purpose of traveler, traveler type, name of airline, flight number airport of arrival seat number optional because a lot of people don't select the seat till the last moment right now i'm in step four where you need to put your destination upon arrival in uh, philippines hotel and contact information now it is asking for the health declaration covid 19 vaccine first dose name of vaccine second vaccine then it is asking for an antigen test country visited work transit last 30 days History of exposure to known probable confirmed COVID-19 cases. Have you been sick in past 30 days? All that information in the next page it's going to submit. So I'm not going to do that, but you got the idea, right? So thanks for watching this video, guys. Please subscribe to the channel. And uh, always I wait for your feedback. Please provide me your feedback. Thank you.